A five year old boy is recovering from injuries after he was attacked by a mountain lion at Malibu Creek State Park. That animal was put down as a result of that terrifying incident. KTLA Vice Jennifer McGraw live now in Tarzana with an update from wildlife officials. Jennifer. Yeah, Glenn and Lou, no doubt a frightening situation for this little boy and his family. They were just picnicking in the park when that big puma pounced on their picnic. A five year old boy attacked by a mountain lion in the barbecue area of Tapia Park in Malibu Creek State Park. The child's family was right there, just feet away, when the lion grabbed him by the head and started to run. His father began fighting back, and eventually the cat lets go. Unusual circumstances because lions don't usually attack people. Captain Patrick Foy with the California Department of Fish and Wildlife says big cat attacks are rare, but it happens. We've had two this year, the first in Northern California. Uh, in the rural part of El Dorado County and two young, young, strong guys, 18 and 21 years old, very comfortable and competent in the woods. And they were two were attacked by one mountain lion and fought them both. And unfortunately, the oldest brother was killed by the lion. In the latest attack, the five year old boy was airlifted to a local hospital and is expected to be OK. Back in 2021, a similar story just a couple miles away from there. Another five year old boy was playing in the front yard when a mountain lion jumped out of the woods and began dragging him 45 yards away. The boy's mother bravely fought back and the cat took off. In both cases, the mountain lion was euthanized, citing public safety, which some may disagree with, but the department says they have no other option. If you have a lion that has attacked and arguably tried to kill a small child, where do you bring that lion? Um, people say, well, bring it to the middle of nowhere, but they frequently don't necessarily point to a county in the state of California and say, well, I think that county is the middle of nowhere. And we'll have people say, you know, bring it to the other side of the Sierra. The, that way it can't possibly come back. And the people who live in Inyo County and Mono County and Alpine and Lassen County are going to say, well, no, that's not a fair to do that. So anyway, that kind of um, relocating it to the middle of nowhere. There's no such thing as the middle of nowhere in the state of California. There's 39 million of us. At last check, the family tells us the boy was released from the hospital, but came back to Tarzana for an eye injury. We're all hoping for a speedy recovery. Live in Tarzana, Jennifer McGraw, KTLA 5 News. Thank you, Jennifer.